Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Mia. I know I haven't posted in a while and I know I say this every video I ever post, but trying to rebrand my YouTube a little, I kind of deleted some old videos and now there are more to come. So today I'm going to do a little unboxing. I've received a bunch of different packages in the past week or so um, from a bunch of different brands. Um, yes, it is all gifting, but obviously we'll still give my honest opinion. Um, I get excited, honestly, about every package I open, so, you know, I usually like everything. <laughs> um, I also might try on a few of the items that I got, too, so that will be closer to the end of the video. Um, I opened some of the packages already just because they were, like, taking up so much space in my apartment. Um, so some of them have already seen some of the items, but some of them are also still in the boxes. You can see behind me. Um, so, yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so a PR agency sent me these. These are from Vitamin A Swim. Come in these little. These are um, bike shorts. I love the color. And then I got this matching bra top to go with it. I also saw on their um, website that this can like also be a bikini because they have. The matching bikini bottoms to it as well but i decided i want more of like the workout set um i got a size small in both of these i'm between an extra small and small for bottoms but a small in tops i like them to be like a little bit roomier on top but so these are small but i'm hoping they'll fit they feel pretty tight so i think they'll be good i think i also got a bikini from them let's see and these say swim responsibly on the back also, these bags are 100% biodegradable and recyclable and backyard compostable. Hmm, that's pretty cool. I love this metallic fabric. How cute. I also love bikinis that are ties on the sides. Those are my favorite. Um, I don't really like when they aren't adjustable because I like to wear my bikinis like a little bit higher. And then this is the top. I love a triangle top too. That's like my favorite style. Love string bikinis. I got the top in an extra small because I don't like when like the triangle takes up like my whole top. And then I think I got, I got the bottoms an extra small too because since they are adjustable. These are from triangle bikinis. I actually haven't had a triangle bikini since probably like high school when they were really big and new when they were like the this material like the scuba material and now they've like completely changed their line and have a bunch of different options and I love that they're sent in these like this is so convenient also my roommate's cat Daisy might might make an appearance so oh this is so cute actually I picked these out but I always forget what I ordered just because I get so much sent to me I'm very fortunate so this is the top, how cute is that? So I love this, also adjustable. I got a size small in this. This is so cute. I have a few trips coming up soon uh, to Miami, so very excited to wear all these swimmies. I love this set and the final touch is it actually has matching shorts too which are the same material. It's like the swim material. Look how cute. I can't wait to wear this. And so like it can be like the cover up with the shorts. I love this. I feel like it's like, I love the gingham print and it's like a picnic. I'm gonna put it back into my little neoprene bag. I got a size small in all of those items. Another triangle bikini, also in one of these bags. It says triangle on it. Um, okay, let's see what we got in here. So this bikini actually is like the same exact color as this bag, which is pretty cute. This is really cute. I love this color, especially when I'm tan. Right now I'm a little pasty, so I don't know if it would look good. And then I got this string bottom. So like the same as the blue printed one but just in this shiny gold beige color. And it says triangle on the back. 
Next up, same PR agency. They sent me a lot of stuff, which was super nice of them. First of all, these cases are so cute. Um, so they sent me two pairs. I love these black sunglasses. I'll try them on. I like that the um, shades are like not too dark. Like I hate when they're like super black and you can kind of see my eyes a little. These are the other ones. These will look really cute with my beige triangle bikini. Oh, these are cute. Kind of like match my hair color. <laughs> these are like very solid plastic, which I like. So they're not like those cheapy sunglasses you can get on Amazon, which I also love those because they're so cheap, but it's nice to have a higher quality pair as well. Um, I don't know how to pronounce this one. SXA. I don't know. ShopSXA.com. I will also link everything below and I will tell you my sizes, all of that fun stuff. And some of these things I do have discount codes for, so those will be in the description box as well. I like that this came in like a cute little box. I like when they have good packaging. Less is more, which means I'm assuming this bikini is pretty skimpy. Okay, so it's definitely like a, oh, I think I make it like this. So it's like a monokini one piece. So this is the front and I'm pretty, I'd imagine that it crosses over because I can't imagine it would be like this. So I think you wear it like this. This would look very cute in Miami. Love a white swimsuit in Miami. Yeah, and the material feels super nice. It's double lined, so it definitely won't be see-through. Next up. This box is from Drunk Elephant. They always send the best PR boxes. Um, first of all, absolutely love their skincare. It's like super high quality. It is expensive, but honestly, in my opinion, it's very worth it. I use their stuff day and night. Um, so let's see what's in here. I remember them emailing me and it is, um, ooh, look how cute. It is, um, body stuff, I'm pretty sure. So usually in their PR boxes, they always have, like, something that's not skincare, like a goodie. Like, they've sent me, like, a backgammon game, which I don't know how to play. And then they also sent a tambourine once, which was really cute. And this time... Oh, I think this is a blanket. It's really heavy. How cute. This is so cute. Has their emblem on the back. Oh my God, this is like such a heavy, high quality blanket. What a good gift. So yes, it is a super cozy blanket because it is all body stuff that they sent, so you would feel so good that you can lay around naked or have the cozy blanket in case it gets drafty. <laughs> That's pretty cute. TLC Glycolic Body Lotion. I have this in their face, like their face one. Um, I think it's a serum. It's like a pretty big bottle. I'm not sure how much this is, but I will link the product down below. So this is actually an exfoliant because of the glycolic in it. So it helps like get off all the, those dead skin cells, which is great for winter because my skin has been so dry lately. It is the scalp scrub. So this is the same kind of thing, which is going to um, exfoliate your scalp, which I love. I love all hair treatments. I'm like totally addicted. Oh, and it has this nice applicator. So I guess you can just go like that. And the last one, ooh, this one sounds like it's going to smell good. Um, sugared coffee almond milk scrub. So it's supposed to smooth and soften. You see? Mmm, oh my gosh, it smells so good. It's like almond and coffee, and it's literally just like, looks kind of like cookie dough. <laughs> I love their products, so I'll definitely let you guys know. How much I like these. I love all their skincare products, so I'm assuming I'm gonna love these as well. So these are from Glassons, Glassons, Glassoons. I don't ever know how to say this. Glassons, Glassons. I don't know. But that Infinity Creative PR agency also sent me this stuff. So let's see what we got. 
Oh, Daisy's coming over and she's like getting into all the boxes. <laughs> so this is a cute little halter. I picked out um, some things that I would want for my trip in Miami. Oops, I can't get this right. Okay, there we go. She's trying to attack the strings. Cute little halter, ties in the back, and has like the ruching detail around the boobs, which I love. Oops. Cute, right? And then what else? I think these are pants. Like I said, I did pick these things out, but I never can remember. Oh yes, these are pants. White for Miami, of course. So I got these in a size Australian 6, which I think that's a 2 in US. Really cute. They're like high-waisted slacks. I hope they're long enough for me. My biggest issue is pants are never long enough for me. And last thing from them is a pair of shorts. Oh, these are super cute. I'm going to love these. I love this color. I got these in a size six as well. Um, I think their stuff tends to run a little bit big because I'm usually like a size two or four, but I'm definitely the smallest size in glasses, whatever. I have no idea. I'm so bad at pronouncing names, but I love this color and I love how they like kind of like come out a little bit like that. I'm definitely, definitely not gonna be able to pronounce this name a purse company and I was so excited for them to reach out to me because I actually never heard of them but their purses looked super high quality and I just love I'm an accessories girl so they came in these little bags which I already took them out because I was so excited to open this package um so the first one I have to like take off some of this wrapping but love a neutral purse has like embossed croc on it so this is it Love that, and it has the hooks for the straps, which are wrapped in here, which I will unwrap for you guys. And then it this flips out like that, and then you kind of lift it down. So cute, and these are all real leather. They're pretty pricey, but um, let's see if it says the price. I think they're like a few hundred dollars, but honestly, the leather feels super nice and they'll last you a long time, so. Okay, so here's the strap. Okay, and it hooks on from here, so you open these up. I'm too lazy to do that right now. And then you can also make it shorter and tighter with this, or shorter and longer, whatever, with this. As you guys can tell from my Instagram, I'm not usually like a color girl, but I've been trying to add more colors in my wardrobe. I just love neutrals, um, like literally wearing brown and tan. And my whole apartment is neutral. Now, minus this, this is like, Nice pop of color over there. Look how cute. I love that. Same little gold detail, but this one is more like quilted, I guess. How fun. And then opens the same way. All that. And then there's also like this little back pouch. Oops. Back pouch as well. This leather feels like amazing. It's so soft and nice. So cute. So shoulder bag and crossbody. Looks really cute crossbody because it's so small. Love that. So I would definitely recommend this brand. I'm sure these purses are gonna last me so long. Oh, it has like a little cute butterfly embroidered inside. You see that? I'll post these on Instagram. You can see how I style them. I haven't taken photos in any of this stuff yet because I've been waiting to do this YouTube video and I knew if I took photos in them then they would never see the light of day on YouTube, so. So these are from Petal and Pup. I'm assuming that's how you say it. Um, this is from that PR agency, Infinity Creative. And so let's start with these shoes, which I'm very excited about. These are, I think, Bellini. Super cute, love the embossed croc. Also love a light colored like cream booty and they have like the wooden heel which is really cute. Very excited to wear these and style them. They'll be on my Instagram, no doubt. Next up is this camel jacket. I am like obsessed with jackets. I have a whole 
closet that's just for coats even though I live in California and it like doesn't get that cold but I recently moved towards the beach and now it's like way colder over here so these kinds of jackets are perfect because they're obviously you can tell how thin it is so it's basically just like wearing a sweater but I just love layers and the look of layers and just accessorizing them and did I mention this is infinity creative as well they are very kind to me obviously so this is from Petal and Pup this like shearling jacket that's leather I feel like a lot of brands sell these kinds of jackets um I have one that's all black and then I have one that's just beige so I was like maybe I need one that's both colors but this one's a little bit thicker so I might not wear it as much here but more so when I'm traveling okay infinity creative again shout out to you guys so I got this button down in this green color which I absolutely love um, I love button downs. I always wear them on top of everything, especially when I'm feeling like lazy. I'll just put on like jean shorts and a shirt like this and then this on top. This would be so cute with the crossbody around it. Love that. Also, I didn't even mention the brand. This is Nia, Naya, N-I-A. I'm not sure. We'll go with Nia because it rhymes with Mia. Super cute. Ooh, the collar's like all messed up. And then I have the matching skirt to that. So that will be adorable with the blazer opened up. Also, I was holding it up wrong. It goes, the button goes on the side. So, yes. This box next. And then I only have one more thing to show after. So this, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know my love for Donabella hair extensions. So Donabella hair extensions, um, I don't know if you guys use hair extensions, but I'm obsessed with them. Okay, so my camera just died, so I don't really remember where I left off. Hello, Miss Daisy. Um, but I was talking about Donabella, I just don't remember exactly what I was saying. But, aren't we cute? <laughs> um, I was saying that they are my favorite extensions. I do work with the brand and I do make commission off them. They do not pay me like per post, but I do have a um, discount code and I do make commission. So I am addicted to their um, tape and extensions. I do them myself. I So I have them in right now. This is my natural hair length, but I do have a few. I have one, two pieces on each side framing my face because I do have some breakage around my face and I just like that. I have more hair covering my face because without them I just feel like my hair looks kind of thin and sad but they're so easy especially if you're just doing what I do to frame your face and not doing the back of your head you can do them completely on your own so I part my hair I'll make like another video if you guys are interested on how I do them but I part my hair and just stick each side on and done and then I have to trim them a little I got like hair cutting scissors from Amazon and I just trim them myself and they look this good. Like you could really never tell, but they are like hiding under here. If you can see right here. Um, so I have two, four, six, eight pieces. So we don't even have a full pack in my head. And one of these packs, like depending on length, it can range from like 60 to like a hundred bucks, I think. I'm gonna fact check myself and I'll link everything down below and I'll include my discount code down below but super affordable just to give you that extra volume. If you are doing it for length, you need a ton of these packs. So like, this will be all for length. And they have really long lengths, like 22 inches, which will literally be down to here. I did that once, um, not this past New Year's, the New Year's before, my hair was like all the way down to my waist. Loved it, but it's a lot of work. It's so hard to wash your hair with that much hair in your head. Um, but like I said, this hair is amazing. It lasts forever. So like if I wasn't cutting mine so much, I could use the same hair for a year and it would still look great. You can, um, tone them. It's all obviously real hair. Um, and then, like I said, I cut them myself. I also do them for my roommate, Deb. She does hers for length usually. So it takes me like 30 minutes to an hour to do her whole head. And, and then I trim it for her. And then sometimes if I'm doing some length, she'll do the back of my head for me. And honestly, we save so much money because if you're going to a salon, you're paying at least $200 for someone to install them into your head. And if you can do them at home, then I don't know. I'm always down to save a buck. 
have to be careful with them because they can be damaging the tape ends. I'm super careful. I don't pick at them. I don't pull at them. I brush my hair very carefully. Um, since it's so sticky, it can pull some of your hair out, especially like in this thinner hair area. But if you're careful and don't tug at them, you're good to go. They also have other methods. They have every extension method. They have the wefts, they have the keratin links, they have the bead ones. I like tape ins because I can do them myself. I've never tried to do the other ones myself. I'm sure I could like learn, but this is so easy. So like why mess with it when this is already perfect? Um, one thing I also like about extensions is I use them as like highlights. So say, you want to dye your hair but you don't want to damage your hair just pop in a few of these to give you some random highlights throughout your hair and you don't need to make it blotter which is awesome and you can probably do it the other way around if you want some brown in there too and they have so many colors they have curly they have straight they have wavy it's like the best i really will make a whole youtube video about how I install them, how I take them out, and how I take care of and manage my hair if you guys are interested. Okay, this is the final package I got. This is from Rent the Runway, which I have never tried Rent the Runway before, so I haven't even opened this because I wanted to see what they were look what they would look like. Um, I'm, I know a lot, a lot of my friends use Rent the Runway. My mom uses Rent the Runway. They all rave about it, but I never tried it because I'm like, I get so many clothes for free. Like, why do I need to rent clothes when I just keep getting PR packages, you know? So I actually reached out to them because I was like, I really want to get to know your brand more and learn more about it. I didn't even know how it worked. Um, so they, I'm not being paid for this, but they did give me two months for free. And I have an amazing discount code. Um, I think it's R-T-R-M-I-A-A, -A, two A's. Um... And I think it's like 40% off your first couple months, which is honestly an amazing deal. And their um, subscriptions are already cheap in general. Basically, I ordered four dresses from them for this month. And it delivered in, at my house the next day. So it's like so convenient for events. Um, they have a lot of reviews on their site. So I could like try and figure out what sizing is right for me. I know a lot of people um, usually get like the same dress in like two different sizes. I got four different dresses in all different sizes just because I wanted to see like all of the styles. So I got all little black dresses. So I thought, because I like wanted to go with like a theme. I'm also supposed to go to Vegas soon. So we'll see if any of them work for Vegas. Oh, kind of heavy. Okay. I am going to try these on also. If some of them don't fit though, I'm not going to show you. <laughs> So the first one, okay, this is so cute. Has these like cute embroidered silver beaded hearts and this um, V little bodice. It's by Saloni and I got a size US 2. I'm excited to try these on because if these work out, then I'm definitely wearing them either my Vegas trip or my Miami trip. Okay, so this has like the puff sleeves. I'm pretty sure you can wear them up or down. And it has like a corseted body, so it has like boning all throughout. This one is a size small. I can't see the brand because the tag covered it up. But how cute is this? The um, sleeves are velvet and then the boning has velvet on it as well. Another one, so this one's more simple. It has um, this lace detailing on the bottom, which is really cute. And literally just like a simple, this is by um, Likely size four. But yeah, just like a super simple dress. It has some ruching on the side. It's cute, only on one side, which I honestly don't remember what this one looks like on, but we'll see. Cute. So this one is like a little bit more um, covering up, and a lot you could uh, honestly wear this pretty casual too. I feel like like this would look cute with sandals. This one is a size four by this brand, which I don't know how to pronounce, even though I know this brand pretty well. <laughs> but yeah, how exciting! All my little black dresses, and I'm gonna try them on. The good thing about um, Rent the Runway is Daisy's back. 
The good thing about Rent the Runway is that if they don't fit or if like you like some of the items, you can only exchange like one or two instead of all of them so you can keep them for a while. Okay, BRB, I am going to try these dresses on. Okay, how amazing does this first one look? I honestly wasn't sure about this because I thought it would be like too wide here and be like boxy, but like it's adorable. And probably like you can wear these like lower too. I like them a little bit higher, but this honestly fits perfect. I forget what size, either two or four in this. Um, I'll check after I take it off and everything will be linked below with the sizes that I'm wearing, but I'm actually obsessed with this and this would look so cute in Vegas. Yeah, I don't really wanna take this one off. I hope the other ones look this good, <laughs> but I will try on the next one. Okay, here is the next one which looks really cute, but it's a little too big on me. The ruching also makes it look even like bigger just because it has this detail, but the, I got this in a four. Definitely should have gotten this in the two. I was like reading the reviews, but it even like bubbles up on my back. So it's not like hugging me tight enough, but I really love this lace detailing. And the good thing about Rent the Runway is I can just exchange for the smaller size. How cute. This is like definitely the definition of a Vegas dress. The sleeves have zippers and I can't zipper them by myself. I don't even know if they're supposed to be fully zippered, but it's like really awkward to do. I'm like obsessed with how this fits. I also couldn't even get this closed. Definitely need like a hand getting this dress on. Only thing is, is that the boning does like pop up I don't know if you can like see from the side like it does pop out a little and the arms are tight so maybe that's why I can't zip them because they are like pretty tight and awkward to get on but it looks amazing definitely my favorite out of the three so far like wow I think that you can also wear this up I don't prefer it up it's like very tight up too but I mean still looks great I definitely like it down. It's more fun and I can like move and like move and groove, you know, <laughs> but oh my gosh, I love, 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 love this dress. Literally fits perfectly. Just like takes me in, hugs all the right places. Wow. Definitely just get like the membership just for this dress. <laughs> so freaking cute. Okay. Last but not least, the fourth dress. I really like this one, but in my opinion, it is way too long. So if it was like more like that, see that, that looks really cute. <laughs> super, super cute that way, but I don't think this is something that I would wear if it wasn't this short. I really do love like the hearts and the fit, how it's not super tight down here, but like more hugging up here. From the front, it looks amazing. From the side, not so much, but whatever. So I would probably exchange this one for a different item. Maybe I'll try something that's not black, even though like I love a little black dress. So who knows, but. So thank you guys for watching my video and tuning into my channel. I know I have not posted in a really long time and I know every video I post, I'm like, oh, it's not gonna take me another year to post a YouTube video. So I'm not gonna promise anything, but I still really wanna get into YouTube. So I do have another clothing haul that um, I will be posting soon. Um, and I would love to post that extension video about all things Donna Bella if you guys are interested. And if you're interested in any other videos, like a little get to know me or get ready with me or plain vlog videos, I don't know, but please let me know in the comments below. Again, thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.